This is March 5th at the Rattlesnake Territory. There's nobody at the nest. They did lose a first clutch pretty quickly last year and laid a second. So we do have a trail cam on this. I'll be able to check that out in a few months and see if I missed something. I haven't been here since February 13th because I've been up on Santa Cruz Island. I scanned the rattlesnake territory for a while looking for the adults but don't see any. But I really can't see the coastline from up here. So in the next few days to a week I'll try to get out on that far point which allows me to look back along the coastline, see if there's any adults perched above the water. Don't know if they've nested and failed, not nested, or built a new nest somewhere else. This is the Twin Rocks nest, and it looks like they laid sometime in the last three weeks. Hopefully the trail cam will give us some more specific data on that as well. This is the Empire Nest and they are still incubating. I still cannot see how many eggs are here. And this is a spot I can't stay at for long. <laughs> this is the relay site up at Silver Peak. This is where there's a low battery issue. This receives video from that farthest point, which is where the West End Overlook camera and relay is. And then the nest is further down that ridge out of view. From here, we transmit over to the east of Little Harbor. And then up to a peak that's uh, behind those higher peaks. And then about 24 miles across the ocean to the Palos Verdes Peninsula. So that's how the West End camera gets online. This is the Middle Ranch Nest and it looks like they've laid as well. I'm not entirely sure when, sometime since February 20th. The egg cup is hidden behind the, the rim of the nest, so I was not able to confirm how many eggs they have, but it did roll eggs egg or eggs. I had a conservancy biologist watching the nest and I'll have to check with her on some notes, see if they've been incubating for a while. <laughs> 